probably one of the most memorable was uh, playing out in Racing uh, with their massive screen that they've got. It was it was a pretty surreal experience. It was a huge stadium, um, and then obviously it's weird with with sort of a stand missing. So that was that was up there. The atmosphere in France is always always pretty pretty big. So yeah, I like going over to Toulon and play them quite a few times. Um, so yeah, uh, it's a good ground to go and play at. But I'd probably say here, I like I love playing here in Park Scarlet and the Millennium Stadium. So Principality as it's called now, but yeah, they're my they're my favourites, boy. Probably Josh in training. <laughs> <laughs> probably I'd have to say um, Raba Slimani for France. Um, he's quite a short, stocky fella um, and very strong. Um, so probably if well, probably him if I'm talking about tight deads. Um but been lucky enough to come against some good players in my time. Um probably Marnon as well. Remember him having quite a few big impacts on games I've played in, so yeah. Yeah, so obviously all the Irish Irish provinces, um and then like like Rob said as well, Toulon, um, Saris, Saris as well when I was when I was a youngster, I remember going over there. Was likes of Owen Farrell and people like that playing. It was it was uh, no, they were definitely tough opposition. Big fan of Range Rovers, uh, so I do like the Bentleys as well. Bentley Jeeps, uh, black or white, probably black. Lamborghini, probably something along them lines. Uh, I wouldn't mind having a little old old style uh, Mini Cooper as well. That would that as a run around that would be pretty. Pretty decent. I think I'm a bit too tall for that though. But uh, nah, the old the old cliche again: Lamborghini, Ferrari, something like that. How's it cliche? Because that's what everyone picks, isn't it? Oh, yeah. 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 Can't. Yeah. You're yeah. smarter than that, mate. You're smarter than that. But <laughs> <laughs> I think we'd be in a fight there. Yeah. <laughs> we'd probably be teaming up with each other, like. Yeah. But uh, oh, yeah, nah, we go big big size sat over there in the uh, in the shadows. So yeah. probably. Back him. Everyone in the squad is scared of sight. Yeah. So, uh, I'd back him. Back uh, Lousy's got to be up there. Yeah. I was saying that in the change rooms just then, and Jake Ball gave me the eye. Yeah. So I think uh, I think he's yeah, he wasn't he, he went he went to happy with the answer nah, like so he's probably backing himself Jake, quietly Jake when he heard Jake that question. Doors, right? uh, um, we'll have to set it up. Sam Lousy's got to be up there. Tear up and see what happens. Yeah. Nah. Nah. nah? Yeah. yeah, don't don't show this to Samson Lee, but because uh, I'll be oh, the end. Sam, he's Sam's be out the door first, crying. He's had a couple of scraps and trading. Like obviously thinks he's hard, but Sanj flipped him. Once. <laughs> it's a big moment for Scarlet's fans. This um, Sanj flipped Samson Lee on his back, and he was like a little baby crying. Um, but to, for the Royal Rumble, I'd have to say one of the Tongan brothers. Um, they are scary. They are scary men, uh, you know. Um, or te big text. Tavita, Tavita Rituva, you know. Yeah. Whew. Probably go Sam Lauzio. He's, um, you know, he's a beast of a human. He's a beast of a human. A beast. beast. A human. So yeah, I'd have to go Sam Lauzio, because <laughs> I just, I just know that if I was walking down an alley with Sam Lauzio, I think I could take on the world. I, I gotta stick with my man here. Yeah. I don't hear him squeal often, but I'm pretty sure he'd be squealing all the way down. Right? He told me he's scared of heights, like so. We'll uh, we'll treat 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 him to a day out and uh, and hear the little boy scream all the way down. Just to correct, you are the little boy, not me. Um, I'd have to say Gareth Davis. All right, and he'd be a, like a little rat going down there, do you reckon? <laughs> Yeah, 100%. Rock. He would be, boy. He'd be like a screaming little girl going down there. Yeah. So Gareth Davis, yeah. It's been a pleasure. We're absolutely freezing, but, you know, it's brilliant, isn't it?